Alright, what's going on guys? I'm bringing you the interchange containment tutorial and uh, I'm basically going to show you where to stand, where the spawns are, what flips to spawn, where the flip spawns are, all those type of things. So, uh, let's get started here. Host team will always spawn where I just spawned and uh, basically you want to go cap C and they will be rushing C because they do spawn closer to C than we do. So, you want to make sure you capture C, capture B and then make sure they get A. And uh, one tip I will give you is... Say you have C and B, but they don't have A yet, they will continually spawn closer to C than A, even though we have C. So uh, make sure you stay by C until the enemy team has actually captured A to make sure that they start spawning there. That's just a little quick tip. And then, basically when you're capturing C, you want to look right here into that garage right there in front of me. That's the flip spawn. And uh, But yeah, that's basically the route I run when I in the beginning of the game. I go to C, then I come over to B. And uh, then I go over to the middle, because I usually get the middle pretty much... 99.9% .9 of the time I'm in the middle that's just my preferred spot but uh, you could probably do just as well on left and right is a little weaker spot than uh, middle or left but left or middle are the power spots so basically I like to divide it um, three three in middle um, like four on left and two on right but uh, you could do it any way you want it doesn't really matter that much so yeah so this is left hallway you cannot push into this hallway basically where I'm standing right now that's that's as far as you can go like you, however you want to stand here but you cannot push into the hallway itself so uh, where I'm shooting like a little line like don't cross that imaginary line right there so you can kinda crouch right here so you can head glitch a little bit kind of with the cover or you can take a sniper and lay prone right here it's a good spot as well and uh, however you want to watch it doesn't really matter just make sure you don't push into that hallway at all because even the slightest push in there will flip the spawns because you're too close to their flag and uh, right here is my, this is my spot where I always go to, I love this spot, head glitching like this little tank kind of thing. And uh, you can either stand right there or you can um, head glitch by this little fuel tanker thing, um, whichever one you prefer. And uh, make sure you just don't cross like the line going into that little fuel tanker, like the little shadow. Just don't cross that and you'll be good to go. And then coming over to right side, a lot of people push up way too far on right side, right here. That's You can't push up past this pillar right here. That's as far as you can go. A lot of people like to push up to that second pillar in front of me. No, you cannot push up to there. It will flip the spawn. You're too close. And uh, you can't do it. So right here, where this pillar is, don't cross it. And uh, you won't have to worry about any spawn flips. That's why I mean that right isn't as powerful. A lot of people like to come right here. You can't do this. This is flipping the spawn. You're too close. And a lot of people like to this little thing right here. Nope, can't do that either. Stay behind this pillar right here, and uh, you won't have to worry about any sort of spawn flips or anything like that. And uh, that's pretty much the breakdown of Interchange. I'm going to show you the spawn points really quick here. So you guys kind of get an idea where they spawn. There's one right here on right. And then there's other ones on middle and one's kind of on left. Right here, they spawn right here. So that's why you can't push up because you're blocking that spawn point. And uh, it'll force them to spawn at C because you're standing there. Then the other spawn point, the one where I shoot my Osprey Gunner at basically on all my gameplays is this one right here. And uh, the last one, well there's kind of two. There's one kind of like in the middle right here where I'm standing. And then there's another one over... Um, in that left corner and uh, yeah so that's pretty much it for the spawn points and everything guys if you guys have any more questions leave them in the comments section and uh, I will answer them um, nothing else to really know about interchange containment this is how you do it guys so I uh, hope you guys learned something new in this video and uh, it can help you guys uh, make sure your traps go smoothly and all that type of stuff so uh, give it a like if you did and oh give me some more maps that you want to see um, I have resistance as well so Give me any more maps you want to see, and uh, peace out, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed.